General. The enmity between Miguna Miguna and opposition leader Raila Odinga seems to deepen with each passing day. Miguna, an outspoken figure who has taken to social media to wage a relentless campaign against the former prime minister, recently made a solemn pledge. He will never forgive Raila Odinga for a betrayal that unfolded five years ago. But what fuels this unyielding hatred? Let's find out. Hello, my name is Chief Okuzo from Plug TV. Miguna Miguna, a controversial figure in Kenya's legal landscape, has become a prominent online presence since his return from Canada. His animosity towards Raila Odinga is palpable, with the lawyer repeatedly invoking the opposition leader's name while castigating him in his online post. Recent antics on social media depicts a man seemingly determined to carry his grudge against Raila Odinga to his grave. In response to a follower's plea for forgiveness towards Raila Odinga, Miguna Miguna left no room for reconciliation. The follower begged Miguna Miguna, saying this, Miguna Miguna, kindly find it in your heart to forgive Raila Odinga. We know you can forgive but not forget. He betrayed you and that's fact. But kindly, Samea Hana, the follower implored. In his response, Miguna made a sweeping assertion, attributing much of Kenya and Africa's long standing troubles to betrayal. I will never do that. That is what has messed Kenya and Africa, he declared. The relationship between Miguna Miguna and Raila Odinga spanned several decades, dating back to their close association until the controversial swearing-in ceremony. It was during this event that Miguna Miguna administered the oath of office to Raila Odinga as the people's president, a move that ultimately led to his forced deportation from Kenya to Canada during the tenure of former President Uhuru Kenyatta and Miguna Miguna had expected Raila Odinga to intervene. However, to his dismay, the opposition leader maintained a conspicuous silence, eventually entering into a political reconciliation with Uhuru Kenyatta to form a coalition government known as the Handshake Government. Consequently, Miguna Miguna was compelled to remain in Canada for five years until a change in leadership led by President Ruto who facilitated the reinstatement of his passport, allowing the lawyer to return to Kenya. Despite his fiery social media attacks on Raila Odinga and Huru Kenyatta during his exile in Canada, Miguna Miguna shows no signs of letting go of his deep-seated animosity, particularly towards Raila Odinga. As one of the prominent voices from the Nyanza region, where the opposition leader comes from, Miguna Miguna has been at the forefront of the campaign calling for Raila Odinga's retirement from active politics. In numerous posts, he categorizes Raila Odinga as a political swindler, aka conman. Now, the saga between these two prominent figures continues to captivate Kenya's political landscape, leaving many to wonder if reconciliation is even possible in the future between Miguna Miguna and Raila Odinga. What are your thoughts? Leave your thoughts on our comment section. That is it for now. Thanks for watching. Let's be next time. Bye-bye.